Hi, my little friends. I sure miss seeing you guys face to face and your sweet smiles. But I know we're going to be able to come back to church together very, very soon. But I hope you're enjoying this beautiful morning because today is a special Sunday. It's called Palm Sunday. And you want to know why we call it that? Well, we're going to find out. So sit back, get comfy, and listen up as Miss Sabrina comes and shares with us what the Bible tells us about Palm Sunday. See you soon. I love you. Hey kids, it's a new month. We're starting April now and we've got a few or two special days to talk about this month. And so I just want to start by telling everybody hello and I'm glad that you're here. Uh, Berkeley, Eliana, Michael, Jackson Haney, Willa, Claire, Bentley, Lydia, and Jackson Williams. I'm glad you all can make it today. So like I said, we're going to be talking about a couple of special days this month, one being the Palm Sunday and one being Easter. So this week we'll be talking about Palm Sunday. So let's start with our Bible verse for this month and it is going to be from Revelations and it is, um, everybody stand up and do it with me, it is, I am alive. Forever and ever, Revelations 1, 18. So let's do it again. I am alive forever and ever, Revelations 1, 18. So I need everybody to have colored your palm tree, I mean your palm leaf. If you haven't, just pause the video and go color it because it's going to be part of our story today. All right. So we're going to talk, be talking about Palm Sunday. So the things that we will be doing this month will be, we'll be talking about that Jesus is alive. So anytime I ask who is alive, you say Jesus is alive. So who is alive? Jesus is alive. Who's alive? Jesus is alive. Good job. So, Jesus is bigger and stronger than anything. Jesus is alive. That's what our memory verse is about. I am alive forever and ever. Revelations 1, 18. So, everybody's got their palm branch now. So, y'all are going to help me today with our story. Our story is about Palm Sunday. Palm Sunday started in a town in Jerusalem, but before Palm Sunday, it was just any other Sunday. The people in Jerusalem were all going about their normal life, and then someone said, hey, Jesus is coming. So, that changed everything. They were very excited. The people had heard about Jesus and what all he could do, that he could do anything. He could stop the bad storms by saying stop. And so this is where your palm branches you'll say, Hosanna, Hosanna, yay, Jesus. Hosanna, Hosanna, yay, Jesus. He could make the sick people well. Hosanna, Hosanna. Yay, Jesus. He could feed the people with little food. Hosanna, Hosanna. Yay, Jesus. Jesus is very special. And if he was coming to town, then the people needed to do something special for him. So they got palm branches and they laid them down. And then some people laid their coats down because he was going to come to town on a donkey. So, when they saw Jesus, they waved their palm branches at him. They were so excited, and they started saying, Hosanna, Hosanna, yay, Jesus. The people were celebrating Jesus because they knew that he was very special. And we celebrate Jesus on Palm Sunday because Jesus is alive. He wants to be our friends forever. So when I ask you who is alive, what do you say? Jesus is alive. So now we'll do a prayer. 
Dear God, we are excited that Jesus is alive and that you gave us your son that wants to be our friend forever. We can always say, Hosanna, Hosanna, yay, Jesus. In Jesus' name we pray, amen.